Oh my gosh, you guys. This week in the grow tent is going insane. Okay, so checking on my Hoyas. So this is the Hoya Sunrise, and I'm just going to get right into it. So you can see the gorgeous sunstress coloration coming out, and I just freaked out. That's why I started filming, because look, there's new growth already at the bottom. Okay, we got two new leaves and a new growth point. You see that? That's a root. This plant is already like root bound. It already rooted and it rooted all the way back up. Like I need to pot this plant up now, like in an actual pot. Um, and I'm thinking I might let it graduate out of the prop box and out of the tent. Now I've got a few other Hoyas that are doing great as well. This snowball, you can see the baby leaves popping out. There's roots coming out of the bottom. Like this is insane, you guys. This is insane. So these are the new leaves. And they've got this gorgeous red color when they first pop out. So that's exciting. And then like, look at this. This is getting crazier and crazier each week that I update you. So that's pretty awesome. That's the snowball. Put that back in there. Okay. So we've got this Hoya that I got. The Saba. Uh, something, something. It's got some numbers that come after it. So it's getting this gorgeous, another like sun stress color on it. And it's popping out new growth as well. There's a new leaf. And if you can see right there, a stem. So that's pretty awesome. It's growing pretty quickly. I don't know, you think it's because of the grow tent? <laughs> I, think, I think it might be because of the grow tent. Not gonna lie. Um, the Callistophylla that I recently got, I can't remember if I updated you in the last video or not, but I got this as a cutting about a week ago and it shot out this peduncle. The person who gave me the cutting didn't even know that there was going to be a peduncle. She even said she would not have chopped it if she knew that there was going to be a peduncle. <laughs> I don't blame her. I wonder if it'll actually bloom. I mean, this plant is, oh, never mind. I was gonna say it's barely rooted. Look at this. I just got this, you guys. I just got this last week. And it was not rooted. <sighs> wow. Okay, that's how you're gonna do it, huh? That's how you're gonna do it. All right, put you back carefully. That'll be so cool if it blooms. Um, let's see, I mean, a lot of these other ones in here, like there's the Wilbergers. They've rooted up very nicely as well. No growth points that I can see yet. And I'm, I'm not gonna like be moving everything around right now. Um, the Illigorium that I got, which is gorgeous. It shot out this, this growth point right here. So I'm sure it's gonna start putting out some leaves. Um, so that's pretty awesome. My little Albo Monstera is putting out another leaf right there. I just got this Finley Sonii in a trade, so I'm rooting that up. So there's really no progress to show you on that. Um, also my fishtail Polynera right there. Um, I chopped mine and I'm just rerooting it because I didn't like how it was growing. Uh, so there's really not much to show you there right now either. I just put that in there the other day. Um, you know, but yeah, some of the ones that have been in here for what, four weeks now, they're probably about ready to come out, huh? So, yeah, even this pubicalyx is shooting out all this new growth. It's really insane. It's also root bound now because the roots are coming up. So 
and that's pretty awesome and look it's got like all these uh sun's dress colors coming out on it so that's cool um some plants that are not happy are my varicosum right here and i'm going to just assume it's because it's not getting enough humidity in here or maybe it's too bright in here the leaves are just burning and drying up so I might be taking that out um, my billetai is not I mean it hasn't really done anything there's no new growth but it's still good it's still hanging in there I did just take my glorious philodendron out of here because it hasn't rooted yet so I'm putting it on the heat mat uh, hoping it'll like that this baby will be shipping off to its new home soon. Um, but yeah, a lot of these, um, some of them are newer, so they haven't rooted yet. So no progress to show you. I did get the Hoya Viola when I got the Callistophylla, but it's a big plant. I don't really want to be moving it right now. Let me see if I can get it. Hold on. Let's see. Have you rooted? Yeah, you're getting some roots. You got roots too. You got roots. So, so yeah, he's doing good. <gasps> he's, does he have new growth point too? Hold on. Hold on, hold on, let's see. <gasps> he's got new growth point too. <gasps> this is so exciting. Yeah, so I mean, every day I check in here, multiple times a day, and I swear, I'm just discovering newer growth points, new roots every time I look in here. So yeah, that's the update on this week's uh, grow tent propagations. What do you guys think? They're doing good? They're looking good? Hope you enjoyed this video. Bye guys. Can't wait to show you what next week looks like.